Yo, what up, girl? Can I just talk to you for a second? <laughs> Sorry. You Yo, I'm what up, busy. girl? Yeah? Come back here. Okay, this is actually a legit reaction, bruh. Right. Hello, I'm Celestream, and here we're gonna be freaking playing Super Seducer. It's Valentine's month, and you know what we need to do? We need to learn how to pick up some homies. That's right. You heard me. We're gonna learn how to be uh, connoisseurs. I don't even know what that means, but it sounds like something um, romantic, I guess. Yo, it's A-OK. -okay. But now, we're gonna train. That's our training art to become... I don't know. Not single? I don't know. I don't know why you guys here. I'm just kinda wanna play the game, bruh. Anyway, let us continue. Will we learn how to be super seducers? Or will we be failures and cry ourselves to sleep? You didn't hear that from me. Anyway, let us continue. Also, feel free to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps out. I'm on my way to earning a thousand subscribers. So please, please, please. Okay, let's do this. We are gonna go out there. Look, he's walking like a pro. We must learn from him. Oh? She got a fancy walk. Okay, this is really saturated. Or desaturated. I can't tell. Reminds me of the High School Musical 2 scene where Troy just singing by the river. Wait, what? What? We're just walking down the street. What you mean? There's choices. No. Let's wolf whistle. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna try. You wish. <laughs> That's a realistic reaction. It's just not polite, is it? I told you, nine out of ten times, if someone does that, I'm not gonna pay no attention to you. Okay, okay, that, that option was like legit true. Let's try walking next to her, which aka makes me uncomfortable. Um, hey, hey. listen, I just saw you and you look really um, nice. I'm, like, I'm are busy. You going, what, are you busy? <laughs> Where are you headed? Okay, that was very awkward. Hey, don't I know you from one of my yoga Oh no, not the yoga classes, bruh. I'm sorry. That's that's kind of sus right there. Bruh, yoga classes for the win. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm sure I've seen you in my yoga class. Do you go there? No, I don't do yoga. You don't? No. Not at all? We should try. Bruh! You should try. How about you try? Not the best way to start because she can just say no and brush you off. I think you're really beautiful. Uh, I don't. So I just saw you and I'd Lucky. really love to go down on you. Right. You, you asked why. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta save yourself. Go get some help. Save yourself. Get some help. Also, happy Valentine's. Bruh. What? Yo, watch it be like the freaking hairstyle. All of these are bad choices. I mean, except D. Actually, it's probably D. Ask what she does for a living because she look artistic. But first, we're gonna flex. You might be able to help me th with this, actually. I was thinking of getting a tattoo. Uh, no, 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 <laughs> no, like no, 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 Bystanders just like, bro, just what is going on? Guys. Guys. So, getting your shirt off in the daytime, not cool unless you know that she's into it uh, and she gives some hints. I don't know about that statement, sir. I really don't know about that statement. I mean, like, come on, there's, uh, there's plenty. I'm pretty sure there's plenty. I wouldn't say not as nearly, bro. Hey, you've got really interesting earrings. Can I take a look? Uh, yeah. sure. Bruh. Where'd you get these? There's some story behind them. Mm, a friend gave them to me. Okay, they're really cool, actually. Thanks. If this, the... bro, are you there's telling me? Really much point to escalate. Bro, I would so not like that strange, at all. But you could probably get away with it. Bruh. Are you serious? <gasps> How was it not like her being artistic? Bruh, bruh. Like, she looks like an artist or something. So, bruh, why is the airing option the one? This is making me, like, be confused. My brain hurts. Bruh, what is this logic? Yo, is it me? Is it just me? Got something on your foot there. Let me just get it. Hey, what the fuck? <laughs> bruh, this is so cursed. True gentleman. 
true gentleman. What you mean? This is basically a game where you're setting yourself to get shot in the foot. I'm sorry. I hope this game is satire. Please let it be satire, because if not... Oh lordy. I'm also an ass model. Look, check oh, it out. Oh, Brad, no. Look at that. What do you think? It's nice. Good, yeah? Sure. Have a touch. No, no, no. No, no. no. It. It's fine. Don't be shy. Come on. And really, you can, really. It's okay. No. Look, what? I can touch you. You can oh touch you. No, no, no. <gasps> what the heck? I can get your job. Ah! This was going okay until you tried to touch her. You know, a girl is not ready at that time for that kind of sexuality bro and you can't really get anywhere by rushing you ain't even dating she's just walking down the street what you mean she ain't ready she ain't trying to be ready bro hey are you single because i'm ready to mingle because i think someone as beautiful as you they're unlikely to be single oh well thanks um i do actually have a <laughs> do? No! but it was nice actually good you. i hope you have fun and you know, i'm so good too. she I'm has one guy. <laughs> thanks see ya Bro, that look back though. Bro. Don't need to give compliments like that, and you don't need to ask such an obvious question. So, basically, never ask a girl if she's single. Bro. She is until she tells you she isn't. No, bro. That's not how that works. It's respectful to ask, bro. What you mean? You, uh, what if you go, okay, uh, imagine someone play this game, right? And like think that this is legit helping them. And then they decide to go up to someone and be like, I'm assume you're not single, so let me just. And then suddenly, like, their, uh, their, like, husband or wife looks up and be like, Nani? Oh, I'm sorry for my choices. You know what? There's and a like... special quality I look for, and I would only stop girls if they have that exact thing. So okay. it's quite, you know, something special going on. Do you want to know what it is? The quality? <laughs> yeah, I do. Bruh. Well, it's just when the girl just looks like she's dying to be. F <laughs> I really love how you just dress really casual, and you don't, you don't, you know. Some girls like make loads of effort, so it's good that you read them. Really <laughs> well, kind of a it's refreshing. Weird thing to say. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, just what comes to mind, you know. Hmm. Well, you go have fun with your friends. It was well, really nice meeting you. I was Jeez. giving you a compliment. <laughs> you just freaking backhanded complimented people. There's basically no time when you would ever need to say something like this. <laughs> yeah. It's a neg, you know, it's making her feel bad. And in the case where the girl seems very nice and bubbly and friendly and chatty and whatever, definitely never need to use it. She's very bitchy and tough. Bruh, think what? About it. Even in those cases, it's usually better to Rude. tease her playfully than to say something straight rude. I'm gonna give you my number because why not? Listen, I do need to go meet those friends, but yeah. why don't I give you my number and then you can um, call me sometime and message me whatever and we meet. Yeah, sure. Well, there you go. Saved it in there's Richard. <laughs> Good. Cool. Uh, have fun with your friends. Yeah, you too. See ya. Hey. Listen, I've got a few minutes. Why don't we quickly grab a, grab a coffee? Oh, I'd like to, but I'm actually going to meet my friends, but uh, I could give you my number. Yes. Okay. Yeah, she has sure. been trying to meet her friends this okay. whole time. No. Don't put your number in there. It's a trap. It's a trap. Save yourself. Put a fake number in, please. Please put a fake one. You did pretty well. You didn't get the very best result, which meant that you made a few decisions that weren't quite ideal, but you did enough to get the result and see the girl again. You got the number, so well done. Bruh. Fake number for the win. This was a very interesting experience, to say the least. If you're looking for dating advice, I would highly not recommend using this if you're here looking for like something satire or just to like slowly die inside like I am. I recommend.